Hey, I'm Luke Turple. I've spent most of my life underwater in pursuit of the unknown. But now, I'm taking to the skies in search of new adventures in nature. This time, I'm bringing my family along for the ride. Yeah. G'day everyone, welcome to Nature is Flight. Today we are fossil hunting. We're on our way to Wyoming and we're gonna meet up with one of my best mates in the world, Moondog. I've known this guy for like 20 years. We've done a whole bunch of stuff together. You've probably seen us on Shark Week, messing around with sharks and diving super deep. But his passion is in fossils. It's going way into the middle of the country and finding remains of animals that have been fossilized and are millions and millions and millions of years old. And this is something that he's been doing for many years. I've never seen it. I know this is a huge passion of his and we're really looking forward to finding out what this is all about and maybe finding something of our own. Oh. Moondog! Hey Kaylee, this is Moondog. Hi, how are you? This one of Daddy and Mummy's best friends. Yeah. He's gonna take us fossil hunting. Ready to find some fossils? Yeah. Cool, all right. So we're headed out to the, is it a mine or a quarry or what is it? We're gonna go to the quarry, but first, before we go, I'm gonna take you guys up to the Fossil Butte National Monument. I've got the gentleman who runs it named Arvid who's gonna give us a little tour and show us some of the things we might find. Yeah. Everything here is uh, right around 52 million years old. It's all from the same lake deposit. All came from the same kind of layer. All layer. from the so same zone, and we only have one date, so it's plus or minus a little bit around 52 million. So this whole area is unique because it was a lake and it all kind of settled at a, at a similar period in time, right? Correct. We started in 97, so 24 years, and we've gotten 4,000 specimens out of there. How many of these have you found, Moondog? Not many, my friend. <laughs> you got a horse? There was a horse found, yes. It's a horse, like a regular horse, but they're that small back then, and they evolved to be large. They became larger, wow. yes. So it's an old horse, uh, early horse evolution, protohippus, and notice also the rear legs are longer than the front legs. Yeah. And so it would look like a rabbit when it was walking with its butt up in the air. <laughs> This fossil lake has the most diverse bird fauna of anywhere in the world. So it has over 30 species of birds now known from Fossil Lake. Kaylee, look. Touch a fossil to see the fish swim. Touch it, see what it looks like. Well, look how big. Oh my gosh. <laughs> All right, well, that was pretty inspiring. We can find lots and lots of stuff as long as we have about 40 years to dig. So let's find, out what, we can, let's find what we can get in like one day. I'm finding a turtle. Kaylee's going to find a turtle. I think we're going to get lucky. Yeah, we'll get lucky. I'm feeling lucky. All right, let's go, Moondog. It's called Fossil Safari. It's the only digging site where professionals, paleontologists, commercial diggers, and also the general public can go dig the same rock at the same time and find the same fossils. I'm pretty sure it's probably the only place in the United States where you can do that. We're gonna go dig for some fossils. Super exciting. Yeah, baby, right now. Can you give me a happy dance? Happy dance, happy dance. Hi, George. We've heard so much about you, huh? <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. We heard you're the big boss. Uh, no. He's the manager no. of the quarry. Do you come out and work still? Oh, yeah. I have yeah? to. I have to be here. Every yeah. Day. Uh, every day? Time. Every day. Seven days a week? Seven days a week. How, do you have a wife? What does she think no, about that? <laughs> I'm not married. <laughs> yeah. No. That's probably for the best. <laughs> We want you to take care of your fossils because it's the only one in the world. There's not another one like it. There's no two exactly alike. So you get to keep something that no one else in the world has. How about that? Yeah. I'm standing in what used to be a lake 50 million years ago. 
The walls on the side here, you can see, have been taken down with excavation equipment and the rubble sheets out, just like you can see here. And when you get into the layers, you can see that these are all just little, little layers. And inside those layers is fossilized fish and other animals. And Kaylee's discovering some of her very first fossils that are 50 million years old. Can you believe that? One more. Okay, it's ready. Go ahead and open it up. Let's see if we found anything. Just this little piece right here. Oh, fish! Yes, I fish! I found two. It's the same fish, but you found a fish. Yeah. You split a fish in half, Kaylee. Whoa! 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 Whoa. These are big fish. Oh, I found one! It's a snail! Oh shoot, it came out. A piece came out. It's, it's a big poop. It's poop? Yep. Congrats, you found poop. You're a poop finder. That's called being a mom. <laughs> I got this, Mom. <laughs> Kaylee likes rocks. Yep. My independent child. So Kaylee, what's your favorite part about today so far? Digging fossils. What do you like about the digging fossils? Which tool do you like to use? It's not about the tools. It's about looking at the fossils. Good answer. That is a good answer. Me and Kaylee just found this one here, which is super pretty. And Moondog seems to think it's really nice. Yeah, it's, it's really a great little fossil. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put some polyurethane on it and that'll keep the gill plates and things from falling off. It's just a small fossil. We don't do this with big ones, but we do it with small ones. So it'll also keep the color. And it's such pretty rock. And there you go. And that should stay like that. Well, this has been a really fun adventure. We're super fortunate to be out here hanging out with Moondog. Absolutely crushing it, finding tons of fossils. What do you reckon? Nature is fly. Nature is fly. Nature is fly. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, mate. It's been a fun day. Pleasure, man. That was great. Thanks for coming out. Awesome. Let's lug these fish out of here. All right. <laughs>